Well, uh, I think it's around four or five years ago that I uh, first uh, came in contact with the laser cutter. Uh, in the last year, so I still use it to make projects. Mm -hmm. We had a project in the second year uh, with a interaction design at the University of the Arts mm -hmm. And we had a project uh, to make a really big machine out of cardboard. Uh, and that, uh, yeah, we try to uh, cut the cardboard by hand and, and it didn't work. And then there was a teacher and saying, yeah, I know a laser cutter and you should use that. And so we, um, and it was back, yeah, it was back in Amsfoort. Uh, when the first laser cutter, uh, it came and then we could use it for the first time. It was really, yeah, fun and really handy to work with. It was a really, really big machine. Uh, I think it was kind of two meters and really high. Uh, we wanted to make a machine and we, out of cardboard because we thought yeah, cardboard doesn't do anything and it's always used for packaging and not, not really yeah, you, you have not really interaction with it. Yeah. Uh, so we have made a big machine and try all these little elements and put some electronics in it to uh, have more interaction with it. Um, so it was quite a fun to, to experiment and also with the cardboard it was really, really hard with the laser cutter because yeah, it's really, uh, really goes uh, on fire sometimes. Two and a half years. Uh, with my gradu graduation, I also make a, a big installation called SWIM, Sound Wonder Interactive Mobile, uh, and that were uh, that are yeah ten elements hanging um, in, uh, hanging, uh, and the elements you can put some kind of um, plug in it, and uh, you get connections with music. And I made these little boxes and it was quite fun because I wanted not to make straight boxes but three-sided boxes so um, yeah I always try to make something quite yeah, new and not easy. Yeah I made a few other um, installations uh, also uh, with the use of laser cutter to make the product. Uh, I really like uh, when you have the laser cutter, uh, mostly use wood and you can layer it and that gives a really nice effect. And I really like uh, that I just can design it on my laptop, make it really graphic, I like kind of graphic art, uh, and then really make it real. And cut it into, it's, it's not flat, it's not printed, no, it's got some depth, I really like that.